All right, we are counting down to the NBA All Star Weekend. We have only two days left until the ceremonies tip off. And all around downtown, teams are transforming how the city looks for All Star Weekend. Yeah, I saw potholes getting filled. Uh, the you Miles know. Square is home court for the world of basketball. Fox 59's Eric Graves checked in with local <laughs> artists and companies giving the Circle City its new look. You've probably already started to notice the All Star changes going in around downtown. These giant basketballs are one of them, telling who's your hoop stories. They're gonna be on street corners throughout the city. While local company Dodd Technologies installs stages and everything across the city like this indie all-star shaped DJ booth here on Monument Circle. Local event production company Dodd Technologies is a big part of making All-Star Weekend and Indy look the way it will. Workers are installing stages in Monument Circle, the Indiana Convention Center, Georgia Street, and here on Bicentennial Unity Plaza. You can see the work already done with this stage and LED screen set up on the basketball court with a stage for live music up top. Meanwhile, 24 local artists have spent months creating basketball history on these giant basketballs. The stories depicted in the basketballs are all that of Indiana Hoops legends, from Milan to Ben Davis to Crispus Attucks and more. You'll see the basketballs on display throughout downtown starting on Wednesday. I think that these are just 24 really cool stories about how important basketball is to Indiana uh, and I think that people are going to learn a lot about our history here. We're proud of our city so as much as we can contribute with everybody else to uh, make our city shine then so be it. As you see these basketballs around town, it's really easy to find out the story behind them. You just go to the base down here to this placard. You scan a QR code, hit the link, and it takes you to a Hoosier Hoops historian who will tell you everything you need to know. Reporting in downtown, Eric Graves, Fox 59 News. Eric, thank you.